He's heating up! Oh wow, they, they actually died pretty quick. Okay, if you just have to, you have to use the shield. Those things are fucking awful. My health is getting my my health is getting drained like my balls when you have to pee in the morning. Okay. Uh, we should swap to another shield because we're gonna need our shield. Maybe an arrow. Maybe the arrows will. The arrows will probably do pretty good. What do you guys think? I don't know. You guys think the arrows will do pretty good? I mean, it's always worth a shot, right? Let's, oops, let's see. Uh, that's not the right button. Well, but yes, it is. Yeah, let's see. Let's give it a shot. Ah, uh, doesn't this lead somewhere? Oh yeah, my TV's just really dark. The ancient people of this long vanished town once sought to harness the power of crystals found in the caverns below. Now, Zarak seeks to unlock the secrets of this arcane science. <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry, this excuse me. Shaft he said shaft. Deep into the earth to certain doom in the crystal caverns. I don't remember the crystal caverns. He's talking, oops. He's talking all this shit like they're awful. I don't remember that level being pretty bad. Okay. Let's kill this thing first. Ah, uh, here we go. Okay. Here, here. Fire arrows do not... Fire arrows are shit tier. Fire arrows are... Awful. They are not very good. So let's go back to the... Oh my lord. Yeah, that definitely is the, the more efficient way of killing these things. Fire arrows are not the bee's knees against the scaly fishmen. Which you... Oh, oh, hello. Which just reminded me, you guys, I need to get back to playing Breath of Fire 3. 4? Was it 4? I think it was 4. I was playing Breath of Fire 4. That was a really, really good game. I can't remember what I did last when I played it though, so I need to I need to start writing that down. I used to have a game journal when I was younger because I have a bad memory. And like if I don't play a game every day or like every couple days, I completely forget what the fuck I'm doing. And that's an old RPG, so like I guess technically I can rest at the uh at the um what are they called? Camps. When you rest at the camps, you can kind of get an idea of what you should be doing. And maybe I can just Google what they say and figure out where the hell I'm supposed to be going. Those, that's a really damn good game. I remember getting on sale on PSN for like $3. That's a good Vigi game, guys. You guys should check it out. I would highly recommend it if you like RPGs. It's a very unique RPG. And I'm not a huge fan of RPGs. I like some of them. Not all of them. I get bored. Um, like, I really like Persona. I think that game's fun. I like Pokemon. Sometimes. Pokemon is more of a game, like, series that, like, whenever a new game comes out, I'm like, oh, Pokemon! And then I buy it, and then I never play it, and then I end up playing it, like, a very long time later, when the game's irrelevant. You know what I mean? You guys get it? Like, I really want to get Sword and Shield, but I know that if I were to get it, I probably wouldn't play it. Yet. Um, but you know what my favorite RPG has been, man? That damn Dragon Quest, which I keep telling myself I need to play that shit again. Because I, I got like 30 hours into the PS4 version and then like I stopped playing it because I, you know, I knew it was coming out for Switch with like the orchestrated music and all that extra shit. But god damn, do I not want to play the beginning over again. It's not boring. I just don't want to do it. It's like I need to just suck it up and play the beginning. Oh yeah, I also got Luigi's Mansion for uh, for Christmas. From my Faja. Christmas was nice this year. It was okay. It was key. 
it was it was endurable. Always a fancy time. Here we go with this bullshit again. What are they dude in the in the like PS2 PS1 version those things look like they look like hams with faces on them. I still don't get what the fuck they are. Annoying, that's what they are. But I hope you guys are all doing well. I've been alright, it's feeling kinda sick. Things will get better though. Tide pool. Wee hee. Oh shit! Oh, he cheesed me. Give it a milk, girl. With a 47%. Oh, goodbye, shield. <sighs> Alright, let's bring out the bronze one. No! We don't have the bronze shield anymore. Oh, no. That's not good. That is not good. What am I going to do tonight? I haven't lit a candle in a long time. I don't even know where the fuck I put my candles. I think they're behind my TV. Maybe I'll, it's cold again? Cause like when it's hot, you light a candle, you just want to die. <laughs> you feel me? On the real, bro. You fucking light a candle, you just want to die. So goddamn hot. This is not going as good as I expected. There goes my gold shield. We really, really need to find a fast way to kill. I mean, well, they die pretty fast with the hook, but like, I mean, not the hook with the, we can't beat on them with the sword because then they, they what is that thing? Um, Cause they just block it. We don't have the time for it yet. This is gonna blow. Oh my god, I was trying to jump over, it got me with my big goofy ass feet. Here, let's try. Okay, come on, catch me. Oh, see, fuck. Oh no, that's not good. Shit, he didn't jump back out. I hope I didn't fuck myself doing that, hitting that dude in that pit. That'd be pretty lame. That would be really lame. What is that? Oh, that's the. I, think that's a, I don't know what the shit that is. The crystal contractions that surround the whirlpool can freeze its dangerously turbulent waters. You will need all of the rune keys to activate the magical machines. Okay. You guys ever play Planet Zoo? I want to play that game. It looks like a lot of fun. I want to give it the old college try. Oh shit, here we go. This is going absolutely awful, by the way, if anyone's wondering. This is going so bad. We're probably gonna die. Broke all our shields. It's gonna cost us like 400 gold to get our shield back. I, mean, I guess that's why we have money, right? We is the whole purpose. The whole porpoise. Find the fish or find new jobs. Did we zuck up all the we did? Okay. Let's drop off the time stone. I think we can freeze the water with that. Now that's cool. That actually looks really cool on PlayStation. Look like shit. The water just stops moving, and I was like, are we supposed to touch this? Nice. I like it. Give me health. I'll take it. That's just as good.
You know what I found out not too long ago? That there's a new Saints Row game is in the work? That's nuts, dude! You know how much I love Saints Row? Even though they started getting kind of bad, but I still like them, they were fun. And they're making a new one. Hell yeah! Instead of re-releasing Saints Row 2 for the... I mean, not 2, they're re-releasing Saints Row 3 and 4. Then they, like, put those on PS4 and then stuck them on Switch, so you just kept re-releasing them shits over and over again. Give us the new game. Give it a milk. Oh, there goes the shield. That lasted five seconds. I guess it's better than lasting last in no seconds, right? Oh, yeah, dude. We're going to use, like, half of our money to refill our shield. Oh, man. I think we got it, though. Normal sleeping schedule. What is that? Is she cute? God damn it. Take that flying fish ham. Okay. Oh hell yeah. Thank Lord. Alright. Half of that. I could do it all the way. What else are we gonna use the money on? Food? We need it to live. Too bad you can't buy health. That'd be a little OP, wouldn't it? Oh, that looks like that's gonna be awful. Not today, Satan. Yeah, suck on that. Oh my god, there's so many of you. Will he die? His feet! One, two, three, four, two. Okay, how about I say, well, how many toes does he have? Oh shit, here we go. Okay, now we don't have to summon those anymore, so whenever we, we see, like, that's cool. Dragon head. We don't have to get caught anymore, we're good. We got us the star rune. I think it is time to bounce. Oh shit. Get this money. Pull lever? Okay. Gotcha. Okay, alright, alright. We're doing good. We're doing we let's go get the chalice first. Right? Oh no, no, no. That's how we get out of here. I don't know what the fuck is going on, man. Found all the secrets. We are straight now. We don't have to fight any more scaly dudes. Uh, by choice. Did we cross that? Yeah, yeah, that's where we came in. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're good. Let's go back to the pit. Uh, and jump in. You guys remember Golden Sun? I mentioned that earlier. That was a good game. Usually during the summer. <clears throat> Uh, because there isn't, there isn't a lot of games coming out. I usually pick, like, an RPG to play. Sometimes I finish it. But... I remember... I remember Golden Sun being, uh... Did they break my shield again? Oh, yeah, they did. All that money. Uh... Yeah. Golden Sun was, I think, the game that started that tradition playing RPGs during the summer because I played the shit out of that game when I had my first year of summer school and uh, because I failed Spanish and I had to go to summer school for Spanish every year after Spanish because every year I fucking fail Spanish and have to go to summer school again 
because I was bad at it. So every year I'd have to go to summer school for Spanish. And this is a really cool sword. And I think that's when I started the RPG tradition because uh, I went to school close to my grandparents' house and my grandparents were very old school. They had like this old ass tube TV and like we weren't allowed to hook up anything to the TV because like my grandpa thought it was like evil or some shit. Uh, no, he didn't. He just didn't want us to fuck with his TV. So we couldn't bring video games over there. So I would get off school at noon from summer school. Where the fuck are we going? Oh, we gotta go to the Crystal Cave. Um, I think it's that way. No, it isn't. Fuck. No, yeah, it's this way. So yeah, um... I'd get out of summer school, and then I'd have to go to, you know, walk to my grandparents' house, because they were close. And then, uh... I couldn't do anything. We would just watch TV. It was boring. Watch, like, Rocket Power and shit, whatever came on that day, but... That's when I started playing Golden Sun. And that was when I started making it a thing that every summer I'd try to find some kind of handheld RPG. Because I couldn't play video games there. So. Like on a TV, you know. So then I would just play uh, an RPG because it, you know, I was able to play it all summer. Instead of like playing and beating it really fast and not having anything to do, you know. You feel me? Well, give me some help. Hello, Danielle. I've got something here I can give you, but I've no idea what it is. You fancy a little gamble, Mike? Sure. Please be health. Or just a magic longbow, that's cool. I mean, you don't have no idea what it is, dude. You're like the, the bow guy. What kind of drugs are you on? Look, we have more bows, more shit to spend money on. Best bow by a long shot. Ready, aim, fire. I get it. For those on horseback or those who with horsebacks, I get it. I don't know, man. I don't. I never use really any of the projectiles because I remember when I played, you know, played it before. I pretty much used all my my. Uh, I use all my money on my shield. I want some more health vials. That would be super helpful. Golden Sun, man. I never played the second one though. I did play the one on DS. I didn't like it very much. I didn't think it was very fun. I don't know what it was about. It just lacked the charm. It just wasn't all that great. In my opinion. So that level wasn't that bad. It was way worse on the other one. But let's see these crystal caves though. Because they make it sound like it's awful. But I don't... I doubt it. I don't think they're that bad. They shouldn't be. I don't remember them being terrible. Watch me go in there and be like, oh, now I remember this shit sucks. The great dragon lies somewhere within this cave, but you may want to leave and be a hero skull would fit me. Within this ah, I do remember this. This wasn't bad at all. This this wasn't tough. It was cool. It was straight. It was, it was really nice. Oh, yeah. I got, uh, did I tell you guys I got Star Wars the other day? Like a, a week ago? I got a uh, Jedi Fallen Order. I was talking mad shit about that game. I was like, that game looks like ass. It just didn't look very good. And then I played it. And it's actually, it's still janky as shit, but it's a lot of fun. I'll, I'll, you know? Okay, we have to remember that the chalice is at the beginning of the stage. Let's get this magic bow. Okay. It's like that? You're just not even gonna come back, huh? Fuck me, right? Fuck me, right? Right? Asshole. Oh no, he's coming back. He's coming back. We get my, we got magic arrows ready. Come on, son of a bitch. Try this shit again. He's not gonna try it again, is he? God damn it. So yeah, Jedi Fallen Order. I had like when they announced that game, I was like, oh, that's cool, but I never really gave a shit. The ancient town of Menomi was destroyed by creatures known as Rhinotaurs. They live on still, but in a state of hibernation deep within these caverns. They use the crystals to prolong their worthless hides. Mm. 
I do remember busting those open and those guys being really annoying. So, I think we need a... Oh, he died. 